So, welcome back to the Fantastic Insight. My name is Steve Walter, aka Mr. Fantastic. So, from the last video that we did on Fantastic Insights, I did the unboxing of the world famous Blue Yeti microphone that I just got, um, alongside the unboxing of the pop filter and the microphone foam cover. So, and also, I did the connection of the Blue Yeti microphone to my PC, which I'll be using to do a lot of the recording that I'll be doing on the Fantastic Inside and be on the lookout for subsequent recordings like this one that will be coming from the Blue Yeti microphone. And also, I'll also be doing um, enhance, I'll also be attempting to enhance the, the, uh, the final pro produced work that i'll be audio work that i'll be getting from the blue yeti microphone that will be on subsequent videos but on this video what i'm going to be doing is just going through some of the physical features of the blue yeti microphone so from the top of the blue yeti microphone as you can see uh, uh, is um, the uh, in, inside this microphone and there's the, there are three capsules which the blue yeti microphone can use to to pick up that to pick up sound coming from either my voice or from around the surroundings and the blue Yeti microphone is very sensitive to the surroundings so and also at the back of the the blue Yeti, we have two knobs one is for gain which you can use to increase the sensitivity of the mic and also we have a polar pattern knob which we can twist to select from either one of the four different polar patterns that the microphone has. So the microphone has the bidirectional polar pattern, the, the, I don't know if you can see, the bidirectional polar pattern, the um, stereo mode, the cardioc mode, which I'm using to do recording right now, and also the stereo mode. So if I just quickly go through the Part of the polar patterns, the bi-directional is good for one-on-one -on -one interviews. Like maybe if I'm talking right now, like I'm talking right now, and I have somebody else at the other side of the of the of the uh, at the other side of the mic, so I can put the pattern. I can choose that pattern for the bi-directional to capture my voice and also the voice that will be coming from the person from the other side. The other one is the stereo. The stereo pattern is good for capturing the volume from coming from around or the microphone and from around the surrounding. The cardioc mode, which I'm using right now, is good for is good for like a, like a single podcaster like I'm doing right now. It's popular amongst post, um, podcasters that are recording in the studio or they just want to do the kind of work that I'm doing, you can do the recording and put it on the cardioc mode where the microphone, where the uh, microphone will be picking up your voice, your voice uh, directly. So, and also the last, the other, the other polar pattern that we have is the stereo one, which I think most musicians that are into production or studio work we we prefer because it can pick up the surroundings from from either one of the uh, either one of two different stereo channels so uh for that's that for the polar pattern knob so at the other side of the microphone we have we also have two knobs there are also two knobs which is one one of the knob there which is showing the red light is for the mute button it's for the mute button and also the volume knob is for controlling the volume while you're talking to be able to to listen to yourself um, live to in real time while you're talking. Like I'm talking right now and I'm connected and I'm connected to my my to my headset. I can hear myself while I'm talking. I can reduce the volume to to feel the uh, effects or to know how the surrounding is. And also, I can reduce or I can increase it, and it's also good for listening back. It's, can, it's also good for quick listening back to the recording that has been done, either from a microphone 
or when I've connected it to to my camera or my or my phone. So that's that for the physical for the physical aspects of the body of the blue yeti. Be, below at the bottom, okay. Now uh, let me put the let me change the polar pattern right now to the uh, to the omnidirectional to the omnidirectional. So below the microphone, so that it's going to be picking up. Hopefully, it should be picking up the sound from the surrounding. So since I'm not talking directly to the capsule. Uh, I hopefully it should be picking up the sound from the surrounding. So below the microphone at the bottom, there's this, there's the the USB port which you can use to connect from the USB from the USB um, from the microphone to the USB of my PC. And also there's a three millimeter headphone jack which I use which I'm using to connect to my headset to listen in real time and also for to listen to the playback so there's also this there's also this hinges on both sides which you can use to stabilize the microphone like I'm doing right now I'm using it to stabilize the microphone so that I'll get I'll, uh, it to be firm and not move at will so right now I'll be changing the microphone I'll be changing the polar pattern back to the cardiac pattern so that the microphone so that the microphone will be picking my voice directly while i'm talking so below the microphone or uh, just around the side of the hinges is the base of the of the microphone which gives it a sturdy feel the weight of the microphone is not it looks so solid but not that so heavy that you can't easily move around so you can also detach the hinges of the blue yeti and also use it to connect to maybe a boom a, a, maybe a mount if you are into um, production in the studio or you can also use it to connect the we can also use it to connect the pop filter so i'll be doing that on subsequent videos so the blue yeti microphone the base the the stand will give it a very good feel on the table and and it will also help to reduce some of the vibrations from the table or vibration of the sounds coming from around the table so uh, like I was saying already like I've said already the Blue, Mac, the Blue Yeti microphone is popular amongst podcasters video production uh, video people that are into video and also, also audio productions and YouTubers, TikTokers and people that do uh, professional work and it's very inexpensive if you ask me for the type of quality that the mic can deliver it will give you world-class professional quality sound and hopefully I'm also going to be enhancing the settings on this mic with subsequent videos you'll be seeing me I'll be going to my PC to enhance the settings and I'll be using it to do a lot of production and a lot of audio work that I'll be doing on Fantastic Insight so if you have not done that already and you are serious about content creation, you are serious about coming into the online space to do content creation and also to do your business. If you are a novice, you are you're just coming to the, the online space, you don't want to be all over the place, follow the fantastic insight. I will be taking it step by step, taking it from the novice, we are trying to take it from step by step from the novice stage, we are going to be leveling up. Level, leveling up and then hopefully we're going to be scaling up and taking it to the top and beyond that's that for that the fantastic insight is dedicated to showing you little bits and nuggets on how you can come into the online space in a very good and inexpensive way and make making sure that you're doing things the way that you should be doing them and not be all over the whole place so until the next time when we meet again, if you are serious about your online um, business, you want to come into the online space to do things the right way uh, full and follow somebody that's also doing it and also trying to scale up and level up and take it to the top, subscribe to Fantastic Insight YouTube channel. Like the videos you see on this channel, hit the bell icon notification so that you'll be notified each time I drop a new insightful video right here on the Fantastic Insights YouTube channel. 
I'll be doing a lot of production work with the Blue Yeti microphone. So stay tuned um, um, for subsequent videos that I'll be dropping. I like the fact that I got this microphone. I've always wanted to get one and hopefully it's going to be a part of the success story and the success of the Fantastic Insight YouTube channel. And if you are interested in getting one, I'll be leaving a link below the video which you can also use to get one for yourself and use for your business and for your production work that you'll be doing. So until the next time we'll meet again, my name is still Walter aka Mr. Fantastic and this is the Fantastic Insights. Until the next time, take care everybody and peace. I'm out. <laughs>